the British, they want to bring us more mosquitoes. Remember the Peter song? Um, Take back your mosquito, give us back our gold. Yeah, Mystery Babylon. Millions of genetically modified mosquitoes. That's GMO, GMF, GMO, genetically modified, um, synthetic, made by the hands of man's hands, corrupt and unclean. Could be released in the Florida Keys if British researchers win approval to use the bugs against two extremely painful viral diseases. Never before have insects been modified. Oxytech is a British biotech firm that patented a method of breeding Addis something Egypti with fragments of genes from the herpes simplest virus and E. coli bacteria as well as coral and cabbage. Well, this comes from the Associated Press. I mean, they pay for this article. Now, the scientists always use that jargon so that the reader gets disenchanted with it. It's like disenfranchised, should I say. Um, and basically, the you know, they want like like a lot of other fields, a lot of other professions in capitalism, to make the a person believe that, hey, this is something they can't do. That this we're exceptional. We can do this. Okay? Um, they go on to say the synthetic DNA is commonly used in laboratory science and it's thought to pose no significant risk to other animals. So of course it were thought a thought to pose no significant and this stuff that, that's never been done before. They don't want to try it over there. Do they? In Europe? They're going to bring it here to Miami. And uh, FDA spokeswoman Teresa Eisenman said no field test would be allowed until the agency has thoroughly reviewed all the necessary information. So, of course, the spokesperson can come out and say, no way we're going to allow this until we've looked at it real closely. And then everybody says, oh, okay, the FDA is going to be on point, right? Well, we, you know, it's, I, I, I'm going to venture to say they're going to allow this because it's Babylon. And Babylon is, has been giving us mosquitoes for hundreds of years. Um, basically, if you want to, you know, just get rid of entire populations, sure, you flood them with mosquitoes and all these genetically modified bugs and creatures and roaches and ticks and, and fleas and what have you. Um, it has nothing to do with killing any viruses. It's only going to make matters worse. Everything that Babylon has done has made things worse, except for them at the top of the tower for a time being.